want to get the latest on this developing story. We've been telling you about this since about four this morning where an officer is trapped in a vehicle in Alton. Uh, Jason, what is the latest from there? We have some good news up here, uh, Margie. I'm here at the 2500 block of East Broadway. Early this morning, around about 3.30, there was an accident. A police officer was trapped in a car. He was trapped in the car for almost an hour and a half. The good news is he's out right now. Also, there's a helicopter, not even maybe 100 yards just down there. We just heard him fire up those engines. So right now they're getting the police officer and they're going to put him on that uh, Let's see here. Looks like they're they're working on right now starting an IV. They're they're make sure he's stable. They're going to put him on the uh, the gurney right there and and transfer him to the helicopter and fly him out of here. The good news is he's out of the car. They had also Margie and John. They had to cut the roof off that uh, pl uh, the uh, police car. They had to cut the roof off to to get him out. So right now, the good news, he's out of the vehicle. He will be transported to a hospital condition unknown at this time. Like I said, we don't know what actually started this, caused this accident, but uh, we do know he was really trapped. Let me go ahead and pull back just a little bit. Now you can see that transformer right there in the middle of your screen, that was directly under the car. So they were trying to make sure that thing didn't fall down and go inside the, the, the police car. But like I said, right now he's out of the car and they're going to get him to the helicopter and get him to the hospital and, and make sure his wounds are okay. I'm Jason Maxwell outside the Nissan Roadrunner. Let's send it back to you.